Optivine is one of those Minecraft mods which everybody needs to be using. It turns your game from looking like this to looking like this. So in this video, I'm going to show you guys exactly how to install it. But first, a quick word from Shockbite. It's the new Minecraft update and you want to be starting a server with your friends. And there's no better server host to do that with than Shockbite. If you use my referral link down in the description and use code SALMONUP at checkout for 25% off your first month, you're going to be up and running with an awesome server in no time. Make sure to explore the new Minecraft 1.20 update with Shockbite. So unfortunately, installing Optifine is not as simple as just clicking the first download link on the Optifine downloads page. No, no, no. You have to first have Java installed. You can't just download this one. You have to have Java installed. And I just wanted to quickly reiterate, Minecraft Java and Java are different things. Just because you have Minecraft Java doesn't mean you have Java installed. So make sure to install Java, even if you have Minecraft Java installed. <laughs> now, if you do have Java installed on your computer already, you can skip this step. You don't need to worry about that. I've bookmarked all of the steps in the video, so you can just skip ahead to actually downloading Optifine. But if you don't have Java, make sure to watch this. So what you want to do is go down to the first link in the description of this video and you will find this Java downloads page. You then want to scroll down to this little bit here and it has three pop-ups. It's Linux, Mac OS, and Windows. And by default, it's on Linux. And most likely you guys are going to be watching it on Windows. So click on this one and you want to navigate to the X64 installer. This is the link you want to download. So click on this download here and as you can see, the download has started and you can install the x64 java installer once the x64 installer has finished downloading you then want to go into the downloads file on your computer you then run the file that has downloaded and just say yes to this it's, you know it's nothing big so then just go through clicking next and it will download java onto your computer successfully installed and now you have Java on your computer, but you may not have the little Java icon next to it. It might just be a basic file icon. And in that case, what you then want to do is go onto the next link down in the description. This is a handy link from the Breakdown Craft. They're a great channel with all, with Minecraft tutorials as well. And you want to download Jarfix. It links all of the Java files back to Java and allows you to run Java files. So you then want to run Java and as you can see there we go cool it's run and you can do that a couple times if you want and that should link all of your files back if it still shows the normal file icon and not a java icon restarting your pc may work if in that case restart your computer and then come back to this video all your files should then have the little java logo next to them and then what you could do once that's all done is go to the optifine download page this will be the third link down in the description and then what you want to do is go to minecraft 1.20.1 you can click on the little preview versions button and you will have this optifine preview version of course when the full release of optifine fine for 1.20.1 comes out you can then download that but just download whatever the most recent file is so then click on that and it will take you to this downloads page wait a few seconds and then you should be able to download it properly once this has finished that you can click skip and it'll take you to this page and then i'd recommend hitting this button to download it not this one hit this one just so you can avoid any pesky viruses. Now you can see that this file has finished downloading and you can download your Optifine 1.20.1 preview version. So double click that and it'll open up the Optifine installer. And then what you want to do is click install. As you can see, I've got my, <laughs> I haven't played Minecraft 1.20.1 yet. So all I have to do, and the same goes for you guys, if you haven't played it yet, make sure to play the latest release before you actually try installing Optifine. Just play it and then you can do it. There we go. So now I've played it. You can quit that and then you should be able to install it. I don't think it allows you to install it with the launcher open. So just close the launcher. I'm also going to close Minecraft down here. Install that and Optifine is then successfully installed for 1.20.1 and we can open that again. Game is already running apparently. Let's try that again. There we go. We have now reopened the Minecraft launcher and once this has finished loading, we can then see Optifine 1.20.1 and we can play this version. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. I really, really hope that you have all enjoyed it. If you did, please don't forget to drop a like down below as it greatly helps the video out. And don't forget to drop a subscribe because that also helps the channel out greatly. You guys have been so incredibly supportive recently 
ad. I really, really appreciate it. Don't forget again to check out ShopBite down in the description. They're a great server host. I use them for all of my servers and they are absolutely fantastic. And thank you to all of my patrons for constantly supporting me directly. You guys are amazing and I can't thank you enough. Thank you so much for watching. If you want to see any other tutorials from me, make sure to drop them down in the comment section below. I love reading your thoughts. So please tell me something. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.